All in one night, the Christmas magic happens. This is the 24th of December. Christmas Eve, the stars come out. The families who believe in Christmas wait for Santa Claus to stock up their stockings. The reindeers carry Santa's sleigh, and they eat the carrots, and they use the magic dust that families leave for them. All the families fast asleep, waiting for the Christmas spirit take place. The pets trusting Father Christmas. The morning the families wake up and find presents from Santa and the North Poles and Mrs. Claus. This is only a magical Christmas, to those who believe in Christmas. Attention, this train is going to the North Pole. Please board this train now. This clip must be the real Santa as he puts presents down and he was quick. The only funny bit was he didn't get away from the camera and on Christmas Eve who else could it be? No one. Everything has to happen once including Santa being caught on camera. This video seems real to us as it would be near impossible to fake this kind of video. And there are no signs that this is fake and there are no signs that this is fake. So it must be real. That is amazing.
Luli, Tetu. This clip seems real and I highly doubt that this is fake as it would be too tricky for most 8 year olds to create this. The thing that's clever about these clips is that these We're not sure about this one as he seems a bit skinny for Sando but it might be real. Please leave your thoughts on our website and we might publish them in our Christmas section of our site. Search WCN Newsagram.
me get on the North Pole train please Mr. Conductor? Yeah please yay. As long as you believe in Christmas you can come on our train to the North Pole deal? Yes Mr. Conductor. Okay all let's hop on to go to the North Pole we have a schedule to keep to you know. Glad to see that some people believe in Christmas and you are about to see a wonder of a lifetime.
Good morning class the reason some of you have come in so early is because we have had in a visit. And a very special one indeed his name is Santa Claus so our project this morning in half an hour at 1 o'clock is to try and catch Santa on camera in his sleigh this will be easier said than done so at 1 o'clock this morning as it is chill time for half an hour and until 1 you will all need to take a camera and hide ever so quietly in a bush not to be heard by Santa or our plan will fail. Are you all up for it class? Yes. Let's look at this footage then. I can believe this. Can you hear that? Hear what? It's Santa, let's look for him. Hurry or we won't see him. What are you doing? Are you crazy? If you get in his sleigh and break your back, Dad will kill me. No, I will be fine. Come in the sleigh now. We started this journey on the train that picked us up. The Northern Christmas Express. We risked our lives jumping off of the train. So now we are going to finish it. I'm not sure about this, but just don't get in the sleigh. Or we will be on the naughty list for life. I told you not to get in his sleigh, are you mad? Did he see us? No, I don't, I don't think so.
Santa, do you have a blanket? It is really cold. Hold on to your brother tight. I am having to make an emergency landing. And both put your heads on your laps and hold on tight and brace yourselves. Ho ho. Ho ho. Are you all okay? Yes, thanks, Santa. Am I still on the nice list because my older brother who you dropped off before the crash and he landed on our trampoline with no injuries? He said if we got in your sleigh we will be on the naughty list for our life. Why don't you just get the police to take you home Terry no need to wake up early hours of the morning no go on you have your sleep because there won't be any presents you are on my naughty list for life you have ruined Christmas. No Santa I will help you. I can't do much to stop you trying if you want to change I will give you a second chance. Let's go and find my reindeer and my sleigh. You deserve a second chance after what you experienced. You found my sleigh well done Jack. You shout out the addresses and I will jump out a sprinkle dust down the chimneys. Seventeen District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. Seventeen District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. Seventeen Minus District one. Avenue, 18, 18 New District York Lane. Columbia. I shouted yeah, out exactly six and a half seconds. billion addresses all the rest don't believe. Seventeen District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. 17 District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. 17 District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. 17 District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. 17 District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't again, believe. I 17 District Avenue, 18 New York and Lane. Ho, ho, ho. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. 17 District Avenue, 18 New York Lane. I shouted out six and a half billion addresses all the rest don't believe. Oh shoot. I might have killed this family but I don't want to get arrested.
hear that you was using your mobile phone whilst driving correct? Yes, judge. Well that means as you drove off. Evaded two police officers and driven past multiple stop signs. Red lights. Parked and driven all along pavements and drove off from an accident and failed to give way and not signaled once. I hereby sentence you to 35 years in prison and you are lucky that this family survived and you will be ordered to pay £6,000 in compensation to the family and £359 in court costs. Good result. We got an erratic dangerous Christmas driver off of Britain's roads and potentially saved lives this Christmas. And got a good sentence and compensation order and well done to the police. The courts and judges and family who luckily survived a week before Christmas. Just.